Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today is the final day of Harry Potter week. I know I said I was going to get it up yesterday, but I couldn't be bothered to film yesterday, so it's going up today. Um, today's look is Slytherin, which is my house, as I've said multiple times during this video. I'm going to be flitting between the James Charles palette and the Mitchell palette, which I've been using this entire week to do all of my colourful looks. They're really brilliant palettes. So if you want to see what I come up with, then just keep watching, guys. I'm going to start off with the James Charles palette and I'm going to take this colour up here on a fluffy brush. On a fluffy brush, yeah, this is the fluffy brush. On this brush here and I'm just going to blend that through the crease. Then on a slightly more angled fluffy brush I'm going to take this colour from the James Charles palette, the one just underneath, and I'm going to blend that through the crease as well, just keeping it a little bit tighter. And I'm blending over the edges of that with the big fluffy brush. Now I'm going to cut the crease and I'm going to use the Revolution Cut Crease Canvas Full Coverage Eyeshadow Base in Halo. This is just the white one and I'm just going to, this has quite a lot of product on it, so I'm just going to wipe off most of that product. What I do is I place it on and then I take a flat brush and I blend it out. And then we'll go, you just kind of want to go about two thirds of the way through the eye. Like that. And I'm just going to repeat the same on the other side. Now I'm going to take a flat brush and I'm going to dip into this colour here, which is called Shmoney. Shmoney? Yes, in the Mamma Mitchell palette and I'm just going to pop that right on the centre of that. And the way to get a really pigmented matte when you're packing it on is to push. Don't swipe because then you'll lose the pigment. Now on a little brush, I'm just going to take this colour here, which is called Mardi from the Mitchell palette, and I'm going to pop that right on the edge of that cut crease. Blend over the edges of that very bright green. Now on an even smaller flat brush, I'm going to take this colour here, which is called Minty, which is a white that has green reflex in it, and I'm going to pop that right on the inner corners where we still have that little bit of white left over. What I'm going to do is I'm going to spritz my brush with my angled primer setting spray thing just so the colour really comes out because this is such a gorgeous colour. Can you see that there? It's got such a gorgeous green hint to it. Now I'm going to take the flat brush that I used the bright green on just ever so slightly blend over that white colour just to mesh them together a bit better. Now I'm just going to take a little flat brush and I'm going to take this colour here from the James Charles palette and just pop that on the outer part of my lower lash line. Now on a slightly more tapered fluffy brush I'm going to take this colour from the James Charles palette and I'm just going to blend underneath that green and also further along. Then again, on that little flat brush, I'm going to take this colour, minty, the shimmer, and I'm just going to pop that right in the inner part underneath my eye. And there we go, guys. That is the finished eyeshadow look. I'm now just going to take my Revolution eyeliner and I'm just going to do a quick wing. Now that I've got that wing on, I'm just going to quickly go in with my Happy Go Lash Mascara just to coat my eyelash. And as always, I've just put a little bit of lip gloss on just to finish off the look. But there we go, guys. That is the finished look. I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below what you'd like me to do next. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.